The managing director of a marketing services firm made corrupt cash payments totaling $71,300 to a business development associate director at the Singapore Management University SMU Academy over several months. Jeffrey Long Chi King, 45, who was then working for a centralized AST, gave their bribes to Christopher Tang, To Ngi, from February to November 2019. Long did so to advance AST's business interests with SMU Academy, the training arm of the university, and he had earned at least $140. 600 at the time of the offences. Long was sentenced to 13 months jail on Wednesday, after he pleaded guilty in August to three graft charges involving more than $44,000. Five other charges relating to the remaining amount were considered during the sentencing. Law is no longer a director at AST, according to current records at the Accounting and Corporate Regulatory Authority. Tan, 45, is no longer working for SMU. His case is pending. The two men first met during their national service and were later posted to the same reservist unit. Court documents did not disclose which unit they were posted to. At the time of the offences, Tan was a business development associate director at SMU Academy's Service Operations and Business Improvement Sobi Subdepartment. His job scope included overseeing revenue, sales and program management for Sobi. The subdepartment also engaged partners to assist in marketing its courses. In or around late 2018, Tan asked Long if he was interested in becoming a marketing partner to promote courses for SMU Academy. Long agreed, and a service agreement was executed between SMU and AST on January 1, 2019. Long later also successfully referred two applicants for enrollment in SMU Academy. Deputy Public Prosecutor Eugene Fewer said that sometime in or around February 2019, Tan informed Long that he wanted $600 for each enrollment. The DPP added, Tan wanted a cut of the commission's AST received from SMU Academy. Long understood that he had to give Tang a portion of AST's earnings in order to advance the business interests of AST with SMU Academy. According to court documents, Long agreed to the arrangement and gave Tang $1,200. The prosecutor said Long also agreed to give Tang a cut of whatever AST earned from SMU Academy. The court heard that among other things, Tan approached Long in or around March 2019 to ask for a one-third cut of AST's monthly earnings from the Academy. Long agreed to Tan's request and continued to commit similar offences after that. In July 2019, the Corrupt Practices Investigation Bureau received a complaint that Tan had been soliciting kickbacks from multiple vendors who were involved with marketing SMU Academy courses under his charge. Long and Tan were among a group of men who were later charged with graph-related offences in March 2021.